hello my dear students and this is magdalene ma'am and here uh, we are going to see about fire accident and uh, in front of all the incidents uh, you have quoted down in the previous things i have given in the previous slides like mind map from that you can take the time you can take the place and you can consider what happened and how many persons are admitted in the hospital all the details you collect but before writing about the happenings in the hospital you have to write about the reference number and the report to whom you are going to give this actually beginning you have to start like this with reference to the fire accident happened on uh, you have to mention the date month and year and then you have to say to whom the report is submitted to so these are the major things you have to focus on so with reference to the fire accident happened on date month year the report is submitted to the chairman after thorough analysis this is the first statement you have to write when you start the letter first you have to start the letter i have given the previous recordings with all those uh, details you can refer that next one so this is what i said uh, incident happened event happened and how will you explain that in english you will use only the past tense here you use broke out you use happened on you use spreaded and you say a fright due to these problems and you are mentioning everything in past tense and you are mentioning the time and you are mentioning the date and you are mentioning what is the reason behind it and you are also mentioning why and uh, how it happened uh, how the students were affected because of these problems all these things you have to explain after the first statement next and here of course you are explaining what happened to the students because you are talking about the hostel okay either uh, either it may be ladies hostel or it may be gents hostel so you have to write about the students uh, i mean uh, problems and their uh, recoveries from the accidents so so first you mentioned that is spread everywhere so you are talking about the main hall you are talking about the subsidiary halls and other halls and so probably when you say five students had sustained burn injuries long term injuries you can say sustained and they were admitted in the nearby hospital two ad students were rescued or saved from the incident in the main hall four students were admitted in the hospital with serious injuries and 10 students used fire extinguishers and escaped from the fire accident so this is how you are going to write for that and next uh, definitely you have to write about the recommendations or suggestions that you need to write for that so you can write either in the past or in the negative statements and i have given the uh, starting words of that starting phrases you can use like it is recommended to it is recommended not to and afterwards you can connect that with check the wiring system because the problem is because of uh, short circuit so you have you are supposed to check the wiring system and you are supposed to use more fire extinguishers and training should be given to the students on how to escape from the problem so this is how you are going to write for the recommendations it doesn't mean that you have to write only 3 you can write more than that next slide and here we are talking about the format of the letter to whom you are going to write the letter and then you are writing about the company's name and you are referring the subject that is report on fire accident reference you have to write memo dated on content how will you start with reference to you have to start and you have to mention the hostel happenings and recommendations as i discussed before and last the final closing salutation you have to write yours sincerely and you have to put down your signature there this is all about the format of the report next